Turn the lights on, let's get started. What's up, GQ, y'all been asking? I brought the jury out, I brought the rocks out. This is what I'll say on, on the rocks. Yes, sir. Bow. My first chain though from Bad and Bougie Wave, you know what I'm saying, was this right here. The raindrop emoji. It was a 50. This is from my boy Elliot. He do a lot of my custom pieces. And I got drop top on the back, so it's raindrop, drop top. Then after this piece, I got the offset. And you know, I always be talking about me dripping. So I got the letters actually dripping, like it's drips coming from the, the bottom of the letters. Along right here, this is 60, just a piece, no chain. This right here, this is one of my favorites. I got this after the offset chain. It's a two-tone rose and white cross. They're white diamonds around and each got their care. And then this is two and a half care, but it's a pink stone. So I paid 220 just for this piece right here. I just got this not so long ago from Icebox. Just right here. Um, this is like you know, like 25,000. I want to ice it all the way out. I don't want to show no metal. This right here, this is solid foundation. You know, this management with the home team, QC. I think Wifey made this for P and, and Coach. They gave us all these, you know what I'm saying? Cause we are family. Then this one right here, this is a big diamonds. These are big, like big, 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 big stones. You know what I'm saying? Grown man stones is a carrot and a half a piece. This chain by itself is 150. Just this little chain right here. This is my wife. <laughs> she got the Lola Bunny. I think the other night she wanted to wear it like a little longer because she got a big old Cardi B chain be stuffed up so much. I think she paid 150 because she got a diamond chain to go with it, which was a carrot. You guys share jewelry? Yeah, I might throw on her, she might throw on mine. It's the wife we all want, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no cabin in my game. Cool. <laughs> I be holding her stuff because sometimes you'll just find her chain that costs 100 bands and the bottom of her purse is crumbs on it. This is the bando, it's the bando emoji. That was our first song that was like, they got us noticed from Gucci and like Zay Tobins. And like in Atlanta, it's the first song. So it's like a home base and it's a home. So I put 530 where we were staying at on the north side, cause that's where we came from the basement, mama crib. Then when you open the door, it's, it's, it's the man who welcomes you to the trap. And that's, it's, it's a guy with, he's holding a chopper. You got a stove in there, a rose gold stove, a rose gold pot, you got a money bag. This was 250 a quarter. It's heavy too. It's more than a kilo. This Cuban that it's on, me and my boy Elliot, we thought about this. It's never been done. It's like a new style of Cuban. It's custom made. We don't even know what to call it, but don't bite the drip. This is a yellow Cuban from Elliot. It's two rolls, so the diamonds are a bit bigger and it's prong set, so they kind of poke out. The diamonds poke out a little more on this one. He was the first one to do the prong set. It's like a new a way of doing it. It's smaller than it, it's still 60 because the stones is big. I got this right here. This is a baguette Cuban. A lot of rappers right now is rapping about baguettes. I was the first one with these baguettes. I had this last year and I had like a watch to go with it. It was a sky dweller. I don't got it no more though. This right here I got from Elliot. He ain't do me too bad. It's like 45. It's just a regular Cuban, iced out. It's white. This right here is called Franco. It's like back in the day where it was like three little Cubans and then it's a longer one. It's like what the 80s people used to wear back in the day. But it was a skinny chain, but I made him put them boogers on that thing and poke it out, my boy Elliot. I got some interesting rings. You see what I'm saying? This ring right here, that's the big dollar sign. I got 50 pointers. Diamonds in the middle, all white, all the way bust down. This one cost me 40,000 by itself. This is a Cuban, this is a Cuban ring, a little pinky ring. You know what I'm saying, you feeling good? You throw the little pinky on? Yeah, this one right here was like a little 20. This right here, it's a star, cause I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a star, a shooting star. With the baguettes in the inside and the front of it, a little different. This was like 30. This one of my favorites right here, this is a pinky ring right here. But it got a solid baguette in the middle. I got a carrot and a half. This was 60, just for this ring. This right here, this is a little, little 9,000, a little ice on the top, not too special. My boy Metro and my brother Cash, it's a lightning bolt inside of a clock because his album was called Perfect Timing. Shout out my boy Nav, you know what I'm saying? He goes so hard for his artists. We have a residency at, at Dre's, so I get out of the stage, to perform, he like, yo, bro, thank you, bro, for being a part of Nav's album, believing in my little bro. And he gave me this ring. So 
It's like I guess it's the, just like that championship ring. It's also another pinky ring that sit on the pinky. All right, now I got these. I just got these at Icebox. Cartier, bust down diamonds on the side, on the front. This is like eighteen thousand. It's, it's like one of my favorite shades. I'm really gonna keep them on for the rest of the video. They too hard. I haven't even really took them off. Are these prescription glasses? Not these drip glasses. <laughs> yes, yeah, sir. Let me swap these out too. That's not my stilo. Oh yeah, continuity. Continuity. Yeah. What you know about that continuity? I'm like, I'm through with the ice. I'm really stuck on the watches. Let me get my watch collection up. This is a Limon's edition. It's a Richard Mill. It got two stripes because the Limon's is a race. It, it's like 170. It go up in time. Another Limon's edition, but it's diamond out, but it's factory. So it's like 220. When you ready to have a bust down, you should get like factory, you know what I'm saying? Because the, the value in your money still safe. Like a house. It's, it's a beautiful thing when you're learning the watches, how they move. And just take your time though. When it comes to jewelry, just take your time. Got the rose gold paddock, like 120, iced out. And then when we want to get grown, I pull out the rose gold plain one. And that's 100 bands. It's plain Jane, you know you wear this to a business meeting. I wear this to Vegas and I get stopped all the time from like the big ball players. They're like, what do you know about these watches? Grown man watch. So I walked at Louis on Rodeo um, like two, three weeks ago. And they like, um, you know, we have a painter here that can paint anything. So I just sent him this picture. And then he came back like two days later, he like, look. I'm like, damn, that shit crazy. It looked exactly like the picture. What's the best piece of jewelry you've ever given someone? My wife's ring. That's the most, that's the best one. You know, it's a marriage and, you know, making it official, locking it in. 500 bands too on a pair shaped diamond. Big boy with the pink stones that have pink diamonds around it going around the trim. I've seen a lot of copycats too since we got that ring. You know what I'm saying? But it ain't the same. How do you feel about grills? Yeah, I got one set. I don't get too many sets because sometimes they poke you, make your teeth poke out, and I got a beautiful smile. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to, you know, interrupt that. And then my wife don't really like it like that. She like, some outfits you can wear, but some outfits, you know, leave it alone. I got a little one, Rose Gold Pave. Shout out to Johnny Day. But on my birthday, I got a nasty baguette. Baguette grill, all baguette. Ooh. I got so much. I got more than this, bro. It's just, just some of it, uh, including everything. It's almost $3 million in jewelry right here. I love jewelry, man. It's, just, it's just a great feeling to have my jewelry on. It's like a confidence thing, too. It's something you work towards, so it's, it's showing like my work. You know what I'm saying? Because this, this is what I like to get from it. At first, it was two of these, three of these, and one, and one watch. You know what I'm saying? I mean, my head just one chain. Just one little diamond chain. Now I got this, I'm just moving on up.